Sure. <laughs> Closing the door. Ada, you little piece of... You better close that door back, Ada. You can clearly see I needed it closed for a reason. Ada is lucky I love her because Ada... Don't, Ada? Ada, I swear. Stop it. Okay, we gotta get this put away quick. Look, she was gonna... Were you trying to do it again? You're a little stinker. Oh, hey there. My name is Wifey Well, but you may call me Wifey. And today we're back playing some more of Fallout 4. We have been here working at this blue house here in the sanctuary. And I don't know if you guys saw my disclaimer in the last episode. It was in a comment, but I was so tired in the last episode that I don't even remember what I did and I don't remember even editing the video um so I actually had to in a first watch my own video which was interesting but yeah now I know what I was doing and I'm still tired today not as tired thankfully but I am definitely still tired but you guys as always came through you guys are amazing you guys are the MVPs of the channel the stars not me and um you guys gave me just so many tips and resources which i really appreciate um a big one was that got mentioned several times actually was wasteland and i hope i'm saying it right wasteland dovakeen her videos were extremely straightforward and helpful she's way better at the game than i am you guys should just go watch her but anyway um not only that, I'm just glad you guys uh, recommended her because I'm getting very close to 1,000 subscribers and I was actually considering changing my name, my YouTube name, because as I just said, you guys are amazing, best community ever. Like the Fallout community has been nothing but helpful and welcoming. And I foresee myself playing Fallout games for the rest of forever. I mean, of course, this is my, what would you call it, my fourth, because I've done three and New Vegas and Shelter before this. But um, I definitely foresee myself playing this easily, easily for, oh, I'll still be playing this when Fallout 5 comes out. And I also want to do Fallout 76 now. So um, yeah, but anyway, my point is, I really was considering with the 1,000 subscribers coming up, maybe like niching down with my actual username and instead of wifey well being like Wasteland Wifey. And that is so similar to um, this other Fallout, you know, YouTuber's name. And the last thing I would want would be for her to think I was like trying to copy her or something. And um, so just like, thank goodness. I found out about her before I changed my name. Um, <laughs> I'm pretty sure she's been recommended in the past, but you guys know me like, oh, there we go. It's green. I, if, if it happened like more than a week ago, I don't remember. So, um, yeah, but like, whew, big save on that so i guess i'm just gonna have to stay wifey well i mean it's a very like unique name which is why i did it and i also did it because i liked the both words starting with the same letter and um come on you i don't want i liked both words starting with the same letter and I liked, I was really trying to do a name that was no more than 10 characters, just because when you go to do a, a name in a lot of games, there's a character limit. It's usually like eight or 10. And, um, ugh, this just seems like it's going to be too forward. Why aren't you, why aren't you being good? Just because it's an indoor door. I could always give up on the indoor doors. Gosh, I'm rambling. Um... So yeah, wifey well, it's 10. I It's unique. No one can be like, you copied me. So I guess I'll just remain wifey well forever, won't I? So this is, this is not making me happy. Um, one person said, you know, maybe if you remove the floor 
and then repop the floor back in. I don't know if that'll work because I just feel like once I take this out, it's not gonna. No, it's not gonna repop in. That would be nice though. That would that would be very convenient if I could make that happen. Ah, uh, I don't know. Maybe I just didn't have it. Maybe it's just this. Let me try like a different doorway. Let me do all that again. And we'll try it again. <laughs> Get some more door. I feel like I should just like plop several of these down. So I don't have to keep coming in and out. Let me do that. And then, um... I'll put down a bunch of those... Where, where am I? I'll put down a bunch of those cigarette ashtray things too. Which a few of you also suggested I use that. But let's just put down a bunch. Sure, why not? And then we'll just have to pull doors in and out. So, doorway. Door. Which I've been using the blue for the blue house. Concrete foundation. Remove the doorway. Do this. Hold E. Or, you know, whichever. Where did this mat come from? <laughs> okay. Try it again. Hold E. You want it just barely above, not in the ground. I think that's good. Move that back over. Get your trusty ashtray. Position it. And if it's red when you pick it up, it's not going to work. Like, see, it's red. It's not going to work. Adjust it. Hold it again. It's still red because it hates me, of course. Oh no, now it's not close enough. Oh my gosh, it's still not close enough. There we go, green. Now I can try it. And if, if this doesn't work, I don't want the whole episode to be like me trying to do the doors. I'll just say, forget it. Forget these doors. I'll put in like a front door and side door and then like, we'll just be like, no. Yeah, this one is, it, it'll, it'll turn green, but it turns green so far out that it's like, there's no privacy to be had in the potty. This one worked though pretty well, didn't it? I would say that works extremely well. So why is the bathroom such a pain in the booty? Maybe I need to go from in here and try it. Okay, Ashtray, you're coming back with me. Ashtray, you're not coming back with me. This one is. Actually, maybe I need to just work here so we don't have to keep running back and forth. I know I literally just put all those supplies over there. But, like, the running back and forth is kind of annoying, and I'm sure it's not fun for you guys to watch. I was doing it because the ground is not level here, and um, I, I feel like it's going to make it harder. But let me see if I can manage it, because it'll save us so much time. I'm really kind of kicking myself now for building in this spot first. Like, why did I do that? Doorway, door, pop you in, remove, foundation. If anything, I'll be very well versed in this by the time, you know, we're, we're, we're ready to do it. Foundation back over, ashtray, hold E, it's red. It's still red. 
could be because all this junk here. It could be because I didn't put it above the ground enough. Let me try it from over here. It's still red. It's sinking. Uh, I think if, I think she said if it's sinking, it means you don't have it high enough. I don't know, but I feel like I'm going to be a pro door person by the time this is all over. Or maybe she said it was because of the levelness. Ah, here we go. Bit off to the side, though. I don't know how well it's going to work. Oh, yeah, especially since I was like, I want to do it from here. Yeah, I don't know. Darn it. Maybe we'll do this door then. This one is being good and behaving. Maybe like that? It's a little, well, it's a lot crooked. Um, but, I mean, I'm okay with it. I can live with it. It's crooked, but things could be much worse. I'm just happy to get it in. So this darn bathroom door, though, is going to be my kryptonite, isn't it? So, bam. Sure. <laughs> Closing the door. Ada, you little piece of... You better close that door back, Ada. You can clearly see I needed it closed for a reason. Wow. Ada is lucky I love her because Ada don't... Ada? Ada, I swear. <laughs> Ada. Why are you doing this to me? Oh my gosh. Stop it. Okay, we gotta get this put away quick. Look, she was gonna... Were you trying to do it again? You're a little stinker. Yeah, you walk off. She has such a cool, sassy walk, too. She knows what she's doing. Okay, anyway. Um, that. Sink it. Of course, I... Like, why did I... Why did I do it here in all the debris? Let me move you. Maybe... And then I need a freaking ashtray again. I put it up, didn't I? Ugh. I'm trying to work here. Nobody wants me to get this done, I see. Everyone is like, nope. You don't deserve happiness. Okay, great. Good, because we need to get out of the way. So I'm worried I'm going to have to do the door from this way. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. Oh, there's still a... Mm. There's still a little peeking, a little peeking going on. Should I retry? Darn it. I was so happy a second ago. We'll try one more time. It feels like when you have a dog... And, like, you're eating and then you have to, like, get up, you know, because you have to go, like, answer the door or something. And then the dog's like, no, I'm not trying to take your burger. Get away, Ada. Let me 
try this one more time. I think I can get the door in a little better with no, um, why do I keep doing that? With no peeking available. Uh, I think that's sunk a little. That's flying a lot, but that's probably better than it sinking. Let's just try it. No, it's doing the popping thing. I think if it's popping down, it's not going to work. still kind of popping down, isn't it? Darn it. Ugh. Why? Why have you forsaken me? Okay, let's try it, like, right here. Oh, I should not have tried it right here. Maybe. Hopefully. Okay, let me do a quick save. That way, if I do want to redo it, at least I have everything set up right this time, you know? Uh, which house? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I was like, I thought it was this one. I'm definitely still tired. Uh, I don't know, I just, I haven't been sleeping well since this last weekend, so I've just been a bit on the struggle bus, so I'm sorry. Much better, much better. The perfectionist in me really wants to fix this crooked door though now. Cause see, there is some peeking from this way. I got that door perfect and I think I'm getting the technique down. So let me be annoying and completely undo what I just said about everything being okay and fix this one too. Look at that, green the first time. Oh, you know what? Again, just in case, just for convenience sake. Ooh, the weather's getting nice. Ooh. Okay. Door. How did I have, I did it from this way, didn't I? You know, the wall almost looks a little crooked now that I'm looking at it. Probably for me putting in my patch. Ah, um, help me. I'm trapped. I'm trapped by an ashtray. Okay. I feel better about that. Look how wonky that wall is. Goodness me. Ooh, this is looking great. We have doors. It's incredible. Okay, very happy. Look at look at the success. The absolute success of this. And it looks like I have a door here already. Cool. 
So then I just gotta redo the front door and the place is doored. Ada's like, door? Do I hear a door? Get out of here, Ada. All right. Front door, blue as well. It's gonna be blue, da ba dee, da ba da. I'm gonna take one of you. Uh, be like right here. This spot is kind of working out well for me. Structures, a door. I adore a door. Dang it. Why do I always be like, okay, let's line up the concrete foundation with the frame. Okay. So you don't want it sinking at all, but you don't want it too high either. Perfect. Look at this. We have seriously perfected this. Awesome. Sauce. Um, amazing. And actually, this ashtray had got suggested, I think, two or three episodes ago. But, you know, of course, I like to make things hard on myself. And let's, let's try the rug glitch. Which I guess is still kind of like a rug glitch, isn't it? Um. I'm going to make sure there's no crack the hinge I feel like we shouldn't be able to see um goodness I'm scared well, I guess I quick saved I guess there's no reason to be afraid and I can see the hinge but I don't think it matters does it oh wait oh no we're good I think it is no well, I think it's slightly crooked, but look, we have a door. This house has been doored. Magnificent. I never thought I'd see the day, honestly. And you know what I was thinking? I probably should have put in windows before I did the flooring because I probably would have just tried to do it like I do these wall patches. Um, that is my bad. And now if I try to put in the windows, it's probably going to be the biggest pain in the booty. Um, I would want to use these warehouse window pieces. I know you can do doors and half walls. Um, As for the application of them, though, um, do you hear it trying to snap? Okay, before I break my whole house, let's do, like, an official save. I'm not sure what it's trying to snap to, whether it be the roof. Probably the roof. Yeah, I think it's trying to snap to the roof. But, like, I saw it going green a little bit. And like, if you want to snap here for me, go ahead, snap away. So I think it's trying to snap to the roof that I put in a while ago. Actually, I keep saying roof, don't I? I mean ceiling. Dang it, it kind of acted like it wanted to. What about back here? This one doesn't want to because of the wall patch. I think it's just trying to snap up and it's not going to actually snap where I want it. <laughs> Look, we have a window. So dumb. Um... So, yeah, what I should have done probably was to wall patch glitch these in. And I don't know if I can now. And, I mean, I don't know until I try. Um, there You can use doors, but the glass is broken. This door, I believe. The glass is broken. And also, 
think it's this one. Um, and those seem so much harder. Like, I would just, like, rather not. So can I use these to do it instead of the rug? I wonder. Hi, Carla. Carla? Carla? It's just straight. Go in a straight line again. Yeah, you better move. <laughs> I'm already grumpy at Ada. I'm on a short fuse. Okay. Uh, actually, I want this like this, probably. <laughs> Let's just try it. Why not? You don't know until you try. Uh-oh. It's like instant jumping up. I don't even think it wants to think about it. If we put it right in front of the window though, like it really wouldn't be that bad, would it? Because the metal still matches like everything. I don't think it would be an issue. You know, just be like one big patch. What, the, the bush or are we trying to connect upstairs? Okay, let's try it with a rug. I don't know what difference it makes, but let's try it. Do I have any rugs left around here? I don't know. I'll just get out a few. Um, here we go. And it's still wanting to instant jump up. Okay, well, what about from the other side? Perfect. Yeah, I feel like I should have patched it before I did the flooring. But it could also just be conflicting with the height of the ceiling patch that I put in. See? Um, I feel like it's more so the flooring, though. So if I try and do, like, these half glass, what would I need? See, with the pillar glitch, wouldn't work with those either because the flooring is already in. So it seems like a lot of people say you know do roof um well actually let me do roof floor then walls doors um probably what i fine or not fine probably what i should have done but instead i make everything super hard on myself yeah, uh, man, I've really... The windows may just have to be open for a breeze. Um, of course, I'm sure you guys will have, like, a bunch of awesome ideas because you guys are just awesome like that, but... You know, if I did a pillar off to the side... Yeah, but then it'd be off to the side. Yeah, I don't know. I think just because of the build order I did, I think... I may not be able to put windows in on this house in particular. Um, I could try... Where's the rug? Did I... Confusion. <laughs> it is confusion. Um, I think just because the build order I did, I probably messed everything up, but... If this, if this first house um, doesn't have windows, I guess I can live with it. Oh yeah, it just doesn't. 
just doesn't want to know. The biggest sad that ever sadded. Okay, we can try it with a pillar, but I just assume it's not going to happen as well. So, pillar. Uh, do this. Sure, why not? See, maybe if that floor wasn't there. Yeah, I think I've definitely messed up with my build order. If you guys have any ideas for how to put it on now that everything is already down, um, I'm all ears. But I think I might have to just be like, oh, this is an open breeze feature, okay? It, it's a feature. All right, well, you know, we got the doors down and I think I showed the technique pretty well on how to do it with the ash tray. Oh, this one opens out. That is not the best. May I have to actually switch this door around now. Um, but anyway, got the doors in and now I'm just ready to move the beds and stuff into here. Um, with given how much Time we've spent doing this house I'll probably just instead of like fully decorating it I'll just move all the beds into here for now and at least they have like a nice place to rest their heads for a while and then we'll get back to adventuring because I'm actually very anxious to do more of the main quest as I am starting to get afraid that it's gonna get accidentally spoiled for me so um, but I think that's going to have to be it for this one. So as always, I hope that you enjoyed. I appreciate you being a well watcher and I will see you again very soon. Bye.